Checking the progress at training camp of key Bills defensive players returning from major injuries has been atop the to-do list the last few years. First, it was Tredavious White, and a year ago, Von Miller. Matt Milano's in my sights this time around, though, it already seems his progress far ahead of where those other two were at St. John Fisher. Milano suffering a season-ending leg injury week five in London, while initially Sean McDermott saying this spring not to expect Milano on the field until camp, their number 58 was participating in linebacker drills during mandatory minicamp. Now, the Bills head coach believes that his former All-Pro could be ready to ramp up at the same pace as the rest of the team as the days progress in Pittsburgh. Of course, that's not a certainty, and this team has always taken a cautious, long-term approach when it comes to injuries, especially coming back from something this major, and even more so at this time of the year. When on the field, the eye test definitely will be on, looking to see how Milano cuts, what sort of burst he has, and if he's back in the mix making plays as we've grown accustomed to. It's rare for any player to return to be their old self immediately, so I'm not sure it's fair to have those expectations, especially over just about three weeks of camp. Instead, also hone in on the chemistry grown between Milano and Terrell Bernard, who have less than five full games experience together. Whether in tandem or flying solo, Matt Milano's hell certainly something in the spotlight at St. John Fisher. John Scott, Channel 2 Sports.